entitled The Birth of Hustler. Hi, my name is Louis Villa. I was born on a Thursday, January 9th, 1997, with kaleidoscopes for eyes and two left feet. I'm a terrible dancer, and at times I have trouble seeing. My mother, she spent 32 hours in labor giving birth to me. She will never let me forget that. And it isn't her fault, but I feel like I grew up too quickly. See, I remember it like it was yesterday. She sat me down in a chair, looked me dead in the eyes, and in a voice that I did not yet know, she said to me, she said, Louis, I want you to know that not everyone in this life will hold you in their hands as gently as I do. She said, this world is a cruel and unforgiving place that will crush you if you let it. Do not let it, no matter how hard life gets. And no matter how much living hurts, when you get there, it will all be worth it. She snaps out of her prophetic trance and says, I don't care what you choose to do with your life, as long as you choose life. And I want you to promise me that no matter how hard life gets, and no matter how far you go, you never forget who you are and what you stand for. She said you keep your mind level and you keep your heart. Be passionate, love, and live. So forgive me if I skip meals. I'm sorry if I forgot to sleep last night. I hope you'll learn to live with the fact that my future is constantly at war with the color of my skin, and I hope you'll sit down and get to know me. See, I'm the son of a courageous woman forged in fire. She is an uncut diamond that was sold to fund my future. I didn't eat. I didn't sleep because I'm working my ass off to pay her back, and I've never really been that religious, so I don't know what God looks like, but the closest I've ever been to seeing him is my mother. Be able to pay her back unless I work hard and I hurt and I'm restless and starving for a chance to prove them wrong because while taking advantage of opportunities is a choice that not many really ever had to make it is a luxury that I will never ever take for granted so go ahead tell me that my heart is too big for my chest write me sawdust just another wandering youth with two left feet and kaleidoscopes for eyes say it Say it like you mean it because you see they say there is power in words that a man can turn on mountains with his hands but his voice alone can raise them. I am making mountains out of nothing. I'm building with shattered dreams and broken promises in the hopes that one day I'll be able to climb Mount Everest with nothing but my voice and they're trying to tell me that I dream too big. And I can only ever laugh because they don't pay my bills.